What's up, guys? My name is Carlos Bernal. Thank you so much for stopping by my YouTube channel this week. Today, I have a hair video for you guys. And it's kind of like a hair update. It's kind of like I'm trying to continue my hair process, my hair growth, my hair goal without going too crazy because I do have an appointment to get a trim. But it's not going to be until a couple of weeks, which is killing me right now because I'm terrified that I'm going to get impulsive and try to cut my own hair with my own scissors. So... Today, I'm going to show you guys exactly how I achieve this hairstyle. If you guys checked out my last video, you guys know I'm going for the old money hairstyle. And this is exactly what I love right now because it is so easy to kind of maintain in between hairstyles and, and haircuts. And if you are trying to grow it out, it just makes growing out your hair and keeping it longer so much easier and almost like a really fun challenge. And to me, this is exactly what I love in life, a good challenge hair challenge so if you guys are trying to grow your hair out look no further let's begin this video right now and i'm going to show you guys the process and how i achieve this hairstyle the products that i use and and maybe just do some bts i don't know i don't know what's going to happen let's go ahead and get in this video so before we begin this video i want to talk about today's sponsor manscape.com the global men's lifestyle brand that's disrupting the beard markets so if you follow me for a while you'll know that i'm a huge fan of manscape and all their trimmers and hygiene formulas and even their premium boxers that i have on let me know if you don't believe me i'll show you right now finally manscape has launched a beard trimming and styling routine which is amazing introducing the beard Dun, da, da, dun, Hedger Pro Kit. So this Beard Hedger trimmer has a powerful 7,200 RPM motor and titanium coated T-blades that can cut through the thickest of hair in a single stroke. That's 20 clicks, guys. Not a game. You can style the perfect beard with their beer balm that smells amazing with a fresh blend of eucalyptus, rosemary, and lavender essential oils. The Beard Hedger Pro Kit actually comes with the Beard Hedger Beard Shampoo, Beard Conditioner, Beard Oil, Beard Balm, Travel Case, and a free gift of Beard Accessory, Beard Brush, Beard Comb, and Beard Scissors. This is amazing, guys. Honestly, this is something you don't want to miss. Simply go to manscaped.com today and get 20% off plus free shipping when you use promo code CarlosRob at checkout. That's 20% plus free international shipping with promo code Carlos Rob at manscaped.com. So my hair right now is pretty long, guys. My hair is wavy. It's messy. It is uh, about what what would you say? Look, it's wavy, all right? Would you guys say it's wavy or would you guys would you guys say it's not wavy at all? My hair right now, current state, um, is a little bit messy. Uh, it's a little all over the place. It is pretty long, longer than usual. And as you can see, it's probably about, I don't know, I'd say about seven inches long. I don't know, six and a half, or maybe less, um, something like that. But it's a lot and it's wavy and it's messy and it's here to stay. So with that being said, let's go ahead and show you guys exactly how I manage this and make this into something like this. Ta-da. All right, guys, so my hair is now damp, and this is basically the stage where my hairstyle begins. I have not blow dried it yet, and I wanna make sure that I uh, emphasize this part to you guys the most because this is where I feel like if you have wavy to curly hair, uh, it's gonna matter the most, and it's also going to take effect in the way that you style your hair with the product that you're using. So for me, I'm using two products right now, and the funny part is that the first one, it is a Lalabo, let's see if this thing, picks this up. It's a Labo face lotion, which listen. So the funny thing about the hair lotion was that I misread it and I was using it like it was a hair cream for some reason. I don't know if I made that up in my head, but the thing is I used it and it worked. And I, when I was growing my hair out and I was styling my hair slick back, the old money hairstyle look, it worked really well and it left a nice sheen to it. And I think it was because of the moisture that it provides that my hair needs that it just worked out super well. So I was super happy about it. And then I read the label once my product was finished because I wanted to order it. And then I actually knew that I had a hair concrete, but I just got confused because Lobo had sent me the uh, both of these products actually before launching. And I just got them confused. I thought they sent me a hair lotion and a hair concrete, but whatever, it works. And it works really well. It smells amazing. And like I said, I think my hair 
feels good and like I like the way it looks because it does have more moisture. So I'm applying the lotion and it just works. I don't know. It is expensive. You guys can go ahead and make your own thing. Don't don't judge me on what I'm doing. You guys can go ahead and do whatever you guys want. But right here is a face lotion that I use. Um, funny enough. And the first step is just applying this all over my hair like this. And then I begin blow drying. Now before it's completely dry, I'm gonna go ahead and apply the styling concrete because this thing is what's gonna hold my hair in place, especially since it's longer. I am due for a haircut. I'll probably be able to get a haircut pretty soon. But the styling concrete is actually super manageable. It has a nice hold. It's not sticky at all. It's just clean. And it kind of just molds right into your hair easily. You don't have to do too much work. And as I said, it has a good hold to it. You see if I just... Just kind of making sure that I push it back, especially my type, my hair type. I feel like uh, the sides could get a little bit bushy and like feel like they don't look as neat as they're supposed to. But the good thing about having like this kind of old money hairstyle, longer slick back is that it doesn't have to be perfect. And I think that uh, each strand of hair that doesn't really cooperate, it just kind of adds to like your originality of like your hair. So I definitely have grown to like this hairstyle just because there's like things that my hairstyle that my hair doesn't do and I used to like try to fix it or like straighten it or do something and I feel like it just kind of adds a little bit of taste to like your hair like it's it's like you're kind of like your, your unique hair IQ it's kind of cool it's it adds originality so I definitely like not having my hair perfect and just kind of like letting it do whatever it wants you know and I feel like this is what makes his hairstyle so unique. So as I mentioned, this haircut, his hairstyle is meant to be kind of like unique to your own uh, quirks of your hair. So don't get too in your head about how it's supposed to look. I feel like if you just let it fall, it'll fall into place, it'll be all good. So when I usually go to see the hairstylist, I tell them that I want to keep like the bulk around here and I want to kind of like layer it into my uh, hair while not reducing any length, but just reducing some bulk. So he knows exactly what to do and like I said, um, your hair is going to fall uniquely to what like your hair type is. So it's really fun to just like have something that is uniquely yours. So there you guys have it. This is what my hairstyle currently consists of. It's two products. Like I said, I use the, uh, the Lopo, uh, face lotion. Surprise, surprise. And I use the, uh, the Lopo styling concrete. And like I said, the lotion, I don't think it has to be any type of Lalabo face lotion. I think it could be anything for me. I think what works for me. It could be a hair lotion. You could find products for you. I just feel like I feel comfortable using this because I tried it by accident and it worked. And I feel like if you are trying to get this hairstyle and it does seem a little bit more difficult, like if your hair is frizzy or if it feels dry or if you feel like it doesn't cooperate, it might be because of moisture. So I think that's where the hair lotion comes in. And even doing like a hair mask, I think if you do it a couple times a week, might help relax your hair just a little bit or maybe even shrize it just enough uh, for you to actually have uh, this type of hairstyle. So it's not too hard to achieve guys, honestly. Like I said, it's easier to like just throw your hair back, trust the process and let it just do what it does. You could use a um, pomade on the side of your hair on the back. Sometimes I do when my hair gets a little bit crazier, but as I've mentioned, the parts that don't want to cooperate are the parts that are going to make my hair original and kind of like have like my style of the hair strand. I don't know what I'm trying to say. It just feels like it just seems a little bit more original. I don't want my hair to be perfect. I just want it to look a certain way and be original to like my hair type. I don't want to modify it by strain it or doing anything like that. So that's my hairstyle right now, guys. I do enjoy it. I do really love this hairstyle just because it's super easy to maintain. It's super easy to style. Uh, the products that you use aren't necessarily going to be leaving your hair super dry. So I love it because I could literally kind of 
have this hairstyle, apply the products and not necessarily have to shampoo my hair every other day. So I feel like the lotion moisturizes my hair, which balances my hair, the pH levels in my hair. So it just allows my hair to feel a lot more healthy throughout the week. So that to me is like off top, the reason why I'm like, I love this hairstyle because it does help long-term create a healthier hair routine by moisturizing it. So even though I'm using hair lotion, it might do the opposite. I don't know. Don't, I'm not a professional, but all I'm saying is that it does feel really good. And I feel like my hair just feels soft and I could run my fingers through it and it doesn't feel dry. It doesn't break. It's not brittle. And usually when I get my haircuts, uh, and use a different hair product, like not using a hair moisturizer, I feel like my hair just felt a little bit more brittle and a little bit more like there was a lot more breakage and split ends. So that to me right here, that to me just really solidified letting my hair grow out. But I highly suggest you guys check this out. Maybe do the hair challenge with me. Let me know what you guys think about this old money hairstyle. Honestly, it's probably the best decision I've ever made. And it does fit so well with my style of dressing. And it does just makes like dressing so much more fun because I have this hairstyle that suits every style that I want to dress. And it does have this elegance, this elevated uh, this classic feel to like, I think that you embody because you have this like nice slick back hair um, that is really amazing. And it is super easy to do. I feel like it's a very masculine. Um, am I going to get canceled for using the word masculine? It's going to be, it's a very manly hairstyle. Honestly, it, it just, it's cool, man. Like think about all the OGs, think about all the mafia guys. They all had slick back hair. So I just feel like it's just something easy to do. And it's just like, what are you going to do? What do you want to do? So Go ahead, guys. Let me know if you guys think I'm crazy. Probably, but I'll see you guys very soon, man. I'll see you guys very soon. I'm going to be uploading more on this YouTube channel, and I do have a second channel as well coming up. I Actually, it's already launched. It's the, the Relatable and Obtainable. Uh, so if you guys want to check me out there, it's with my girl. Let me know. Um, or just stop by and subscribe. And also, follow me on Instagram by Carl Spurgo. And Yeah, man. I'll see you guys very soon. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to put style on everything. Follow me on Instagram at by Carlos Roberto twice the mood as well we have a new channel go see if you can find the space